Metal Gear Solid 3 has a special place in my heart. It's not the first Metal Gear I ever played, that would be MGS1, and it's not the first I ever completed, which would be Metal Gear Solid 2. Metal Gear Solid 3 was the first MGS I bought on the day of release and rushed home to play. This was one of those games that, that helped ignite my enthusiasm about games, from sneaking about the jungle, to killing a man made of bees. I am the pain. This game almost felt like it was made for me. I didn't need an encyclopedic knowledge of the previous game to enjoy it. All I needed was a pad in my hand. Never in my eyes had a game improved on the previous title so much like Snake Eater. I will give you fear such as you've never experienced before. Come into my web. To cap it all off, it features the best sniper battle ever to grace the medium of video games. The end. The aged inventor of sniping first took me nearly an hour to kill. On one life. I remember calling Joel right after, full of stories about the encounter, flushed and exhilarated. The best games can do that. Metal Gear Solid 3, with all its quirks and bizarre plot points, isn't, isn't just my favourite Metal Gear. It might actually be my favourite game. What other game series would seriously have the subtitle Snake Eater and then turn it into the best theme song the world has ever heard? Flawless.